Justin Bieber was forced to postpone the next few shows of his Justice World Tour, under doctor's orders. The singer, 28, was set to continue performing this week on his seven-leg, 130-day tour, but it has been brought to a halt due to a non-COVID-related illness, which he says is getting worse. He appeared to leave believers in Toronto, Canada, heartbroken as he announced the sad news on his Instagram story earlier today. Can't believe him saying this, he began. I've done everything to get better but my sickness is getting worse. My heart breaks that I will have to postpone these next few shows, doctor's orders. To all my people I love you so much and am gonna rest and get better. He will no longer be performing at Toronto's Scotiabank Arena in his native Canada on Tuesday and Wednesday night. It comes after his wife Hailey Bieber confessed that she was feeling just a little bit overwhelmed and tired over the weekend. She told her TikTok followers, I'm trying to get my body moving and trying to work out and stay on a routine. And I just found it more hard today than usual. And I guess my reason, for, sharing that is that I know Therese a lot of other people that probably feel that way. And I know it always makes me feel better to be able to connect with people on these feelings. So I just wanted to share that and say that you're not alone. There's always going to be people that are going through similar things that you're feeling. And I'm just sending a lot of love to anybody who sees this video today. The married couple were spotted out and about on Sunday while hitting up Moroccan restaurant Café Mogador in Brooklyn. Justin's current tour will support his sixth studio album, Justice, which launched on March 19 this year. He will take the UK leg of his world tour to Manchester, Birmingham, London, Glasgow, Aberdeen and Sheffield next year. Throughout his career, he has sold an estimated 150 million records worldwide. The Canadian singer was signed by Usher at the young age of 14 and has achieved incredible success ever since.